a rose by any other name, it still is sweet. Now, what that pretends is that even though the value of an object or the at least the perceived value of the object has nothing to do with what you call it or the name that has been assigned. So think about that for a minute. Well, that might be, it might have been true some time ago. I'm not too sure about that now because right now we live in an age of big brands. We live in an age of the internet. We live in a digital age where when the products have been made and broken by the very name they were given. Okay, so if you got a guy out here named Fred who's making facial tissue and he goes out here and said, look, my facial tissue works just as good as Kleenex. You're going to say, wait a minute, what are you talking about, Fred? So his, by any name logic, does not apply. Now, what does all, all mean? That means as a business owner, while you're out there toiling that field, you're out there in the garden, you need to also apply an equal equity to make sure that that name can withstand the test of time that has been properly branded and or trademarked. So yes, we want to make sure we make the sweetest smelling rose. We want to make sure we have the best legal services. We want to make sure we have the best cakes and pies. We have the best lawn services. But according to the logic of the day, in this era in which we live, you have to make sure also that that name, it doesn't leave a bad taste in your mouth because it has not been properly protected and given the proper weight.